uh, boys and girls. Um, this is a second attempt at doing this. I just uh, I went up against Axel on this fight that we're about to do, and uh, yeah, it all went wrong. <laughs> it was going all right, and then he wiped out my team members and uh, kind of ended up with one character stuck in a place where I couldn't get to Axel anymore. So yeah, it went wrong. So I'm going to buy some healing potions first before we start this. So yeah, let's just um, let's buy everything. Uh, that's for SP, isn't it? Anything else for health? No, that's it. Wicked. <laughs> so yeah, I like uh, the level you're about to see. I jumped into it. Went up against Axel. And I was beating him. It was going fine. <laughs> Could have beaten him with a uh, Medell, but then I didn't factor in just how strong his attacks were. I didn't have any healing going on. So yeah, did it all wrong. I don't want to skip this really, do I? Because you haven't seen it. We knew it was a trap, that's why we came. So, if you want the brat I'm going to try not to repeat what I said in the previous episode. Don't feel good about that. Don't want to feel like I'm rehearsing anything. <laughs> I say previous episode, the episode I just recorded went horribly wrong. I'm drinking coffee, by the way. <laughs> so if you hear me slurping, sorry. You're the one with the scheme. I see how you're plotting to use the princess as a hostage so you can defeat Overlord Xenon. But I will put an end to your plans. Once I've rescued the Overlord's daughter, I'll be back in the spotlight. Yeah, the not likely. The entire universe will witness my victory. It'll spark my glorious comeback. So, ready to fight fair? But remember, I won't be responsible for what happens to those brats if you don't let me beat you up. If we don't let you beat uh, um, him up, us up, then we're going to beat you up, and then you won't be able to do anything to the brats. Harsh. So then, what are you going to do to the brats then? So I skipped that by accident. <laughs> what do you know? My cunning trap had such a great twist that you're all lost for words. And Rosalind comes forward in no, a second. We just don't want to waste our breath. There you go. Bouncing all I over the place. Cool. No mercy. Kidnapping innocent children just to get attention is unforgivable. I shall cleanse the world of you myself. Huh? Why are you so angry? I'm trying to rescue you, you know? Fool! I do not need to be rescued. I am here of my own free will. I am no one's hostage. What the hell? Aren't princesses supposed to wait for their knight in shining armor to rescue them whenever they get captured? You idiot! That only happens in your feeble imagination. Then what are we going to do for my show? It's going to beat you up. There has been a change of plans. How does series finale? Axel dies, rising in pain, sound to you. <laughs> but that's not how I want my series to end. Can I at least have a happy ending? Sorry, we're all out of happy endings today. We only have ones that end with horrible beating. Hell yeah. Just remember, every punch is for Taro and Hanako. Well, at least this time I can try and do it a bit smoother. So anyway, we'll go over the level. There's a no entry barrier here, so I can't get past it. So I have to destroy that first by throwing someone over here so they can smack this and destroy it. Um, there's no way to get a full clear on this with the geostones because of that. Uh, and he is on the red squares here which is problematic because they have no lifting and no invincibility so I can't destroy the gems over here because it all, you know, they're invincible and I can't pick them up to throw them. Problematic. Um, we've got these panels here though. One of them is defense plus 50 which will come in handy but I don't want don't want the enemies to take advantage of them really. So what we do, we move Rosalind here. I'll send her across again because if I send one of these guys they'll probably get killed before they get there. Although just destroying the no entry sign is important but 
they're helpful. They're quite strong. So, yeah, we're going to throw Rosalind across again. Let's see how it goes. I did intend to do another episode of this the other day, but, um... Slightly pro well, that Life is Strange came out. I quite like that game. I thought I'd give it a go. Oh my god, it didn't kill it in one hit. Oh, bloody hell. <laughs> did last time. Yeah, Life is Strange came out the other day, and I gave that a playthrough. Done three episodes of that. Um, got content ID on each one, so I had to use YouTube's music removal thing to stop the music coming up. And you know, cause I, I was paranoid that YouTube's going to change something about how they handle content ID, and you know do something where a content ID warning is as bad as a copyright strike or something. Just don't know this. They'll say they won't do that sort of thing, but you never know with YouTube. I mean, Jesus, they let the blooming content ID holders decide whether or not you have infringed their content ID. Which means if they claim something they don't own, they can just say, yeah, we own it still. Alright, we'll ignore that woman there who's just hit me, Lolita. Attack the geo symbol. Because it's important that I get through. Boom, boom, boom. Right. Now, what I want to do is I want to come along here and block this part off. So the enemies have to move on to there and have weak attacks. So that's that's roughly the idea. But I don't think I'm going to be able to get all my guys here in one go. Right. Let's uh, bring her back here and cast shield on him. Got my new character there, Joan Dark. She got... She can hit. Also, let's go for that. He can hit rather. Ooh, might as well get some damage in there. But yeah, this um, new character is only level 4, so not much help. Let's get Adele over there. Ooh, right. Got some healing items this time at least. I went into the last one, I was like, oh god, they're getting the one health, gotta heal them and there's nothing there. <laughs> Terrifying. Right, let's get her. Hopefully she can't attack anything. Defend. Let's get the Prinny in here. Defend and hopefully if he attacks. He'll combo with them. No, he doesn't. Twat. Right, she has a fire attack, so might as well use that. Ooh, and oh, use a free can't I? I haven't even checked whether or not they've got vulnerability defense to attack or not. Shield on her, just on the off chance she can survive a turn. Oh, I didn't move for did I? Or did I? I can't remember. I wasn't paying attention. Jesus. I should say a little bit about Nintendo's new content ID thing they're doing. Not, well, not content ID, it's a blooming creator's program. They're basically trying to get you to sign up to a YouTube network without actually giving you the benefits of a YouTube network. Um, I'm not signed up to a network, I'm kind of not too keen, I don't see the point, to be honest. Um, but one of the benefits they do give you is that they help you with the content ID stuff. They have um, whitelists and things so they can stop certain content ID things happening to you. But, um,. The Nintendo one is just literally like they just want to take the money from you, and that's it. And they're gonna split the revenue with you. They're gonna do, but they're not doing anything to help you. Like, there's gonna be no way of like promoting the people who have those channels that use them. Um, and the worst thing is a really bad thing is that they don't want you to have other game companies games on their channel. If you register your channel with them, you have to have nothing but Nintendo games on there and only the ones on their list. So, completely missing the point of the whole Let's Play thing. I mean, Let's Play is all about discovering new games and, you know, showing new 
new things off. But yeah, they don't want you to do that. They just want you to. They seem to think that Let's Play is just about playing the game, but it's not the game that's the draw necessarily. I mean, people might find this because they search for a Disgaea Let's Play, but I would hope that they would subscribe to me and want to watch it because I'm doing the thing and I'm saying words to the microphone. But yeah, it's weird. Nintendo seem to like have no concept of what the Let's Plays are. And the funny thing is they've already said that they've, um, due to the demand they've had for the service, um, they haven't been able to keep up. And But I've seen nothing but people saying, don't sign up to this, it's terrible for you. And yet they're still somehow overwhelmed. What would they have done if it actually worked, if people actually wanted it? <laughs> it's absolutely baffling. Um, beyond me. Like, I mean, a YouTube network will help you. They will, you know, promote you. That's why you see Game Grumps appearing in things like Table Flip and stuff like that. That, that goes on um, Maker's channel and, you know, everyone gets to see the video and it shares on there. Anyone who goes to the Maker's website will see, you know, those videos that Game Grumps have done with other people. You know, it's all cross-promotional stuff. They get you in touch with other YouTubers so you can, like, you know, maybe get to know them and hang out and stuff, do videos, collaborate. See, that's cool. We've got a network thing going on there, but there's nothing for on Nintendo's one. And I've argued before that there is a certain amount that is, you know, within their rights to say, you know, you shouldn't be making videos of these, which is why I don't do Square Enix Japan games and um, why I don't cover women. What was the other one that content ID'd me and I was like, nah, not playing their games anymore. Can't remember. Terrible. Should remember, really. But, um, yeah, if they won't release the claims, then I'm just not going to play their games anymore, because, you know, why would I? Um, but, yeah, Nintendo are just, like, they want to take control of your channel. You can register individual videos as well, but it says that they have to approve them, so you have to wait three days while they approve the video, which I guess means you have to upload it to YouTube and then put it on private. Um... But they haven't said what the criteria is, what they would fail a video on. Like They've just literally said, yeah, if we want, we won't let you post the video. <laughs> I just can't... It's just baffling to me. Absolutely baffling. <laughs> so yeah, don't sign up to Nintendo's creator thing unless they change something drastic. What I'd like to see, if they want to make it a bit fairer, um, you know, maybe if they had a promotional thing on there, maybe they have their website set up where they show other people's, you know, show Let's Play videos, feature certain people's videos that they, you know, like people have become part of the creator program system, which, you know, in one sense lets you know who's been silly enough to sign up for it in the first place, but at least then they'll be promoting it and they'll be pushing it. Um, the limitation on people's channel is absolutely ridiculous, stopping you from getting across it. I mean, that literally means if you've got an existing channel and you want to add that to the creator program system, You'd have to wipe every like PlayStation, PC, any game not made by Nintendo. And note that the games on their whitelist don't include any games that are developed by second parties of Nintendo. So Smash Bros. isn't on there because it's part developed by Namco and Howl Laboratories. Um, it's absolutely insane what they're doing. Completely lost the plot. I mean, by saying that you can't like show any other videos, they're effectively saying that they, they expect you to create a new channel just for, you know, their stuff. <laughs> this is crazy. Like, would you shut down your channel and start from scratch just to play Nintendo games on there? Like, absolutely silly. Well, yeah, I would do a whole vlog on it, but I think there's enough people out there saying that it's a silly, silly, stupid thing. Why won't they combo together? That's weird. Thanks. Uh, let's get Adele in there. She does not want to combo with anyone. Blimey, not even with Adele, and he's got a really high combo chance rate. Free damage. Thanks, Prinny. Made all the difference. Boom. I should be really stacking up these attacks, but I wasn't sure how much damage they were going to do in one turn. Right. Let's get him in there. How far from he's got no Oh he's already moved, hasn't he? I did the uh, fire attack. Right, if I move here, they've got defence fifty. 
so I can go on to that. I need to basically encourage Axel to leave this part as well. Right, let's move her here and Poison Blast is a stray shot. Uh, let's just attack. Ooh, no, someone needs healing, don't they? Let's heal Tinker. Boom. Oh, she leveled up. Be nice if Joan Dark leveled up a little bit. They're going to aim for her, though. Oh, see? She's dead. I do sometimes use weaker characters as bait. Because once you've figured out the AI routines in this game, it's not too hard to, you know, figure these things out. Right. I am not going to destroy that green one. I'm going to turn the tables on him by lifting it and throwing it onto the blue. Oh, and now we have 50% plus. Da 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 da! Uh, Sonic Roll. Uh, blocked path. Right, attack. Let's move him in there. We can use fire. I'm pretty sure. So, yeah, she has a resistance to fire, but whatevs. Oh, hang on. Uh, use that. No, I thought she was in line with that. Freaking isometric views. <laughs> there. Uh, we'll move him there just to try and get a little bit of the combo off him. Yeah, there you go. There was a trailer for this guy. Five came out a couple of weeks ago. That looks really good. God, did that do nothing? <laughs> Both of those miss. Jesus, that's not good. Right. Hurricane Slash. One, 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 one. I think I'm doing better than I was last time. <laughs> I think I'd lost um, Prinny, the Prinny by now. Right. Speaking of losing the Prinny, God, he's not got much health left. Heal that boy. And yeah, let's jump in and punch one of these. I've been playing a hell of a lot of Advance Wars recently. I got a Wii U a couple of weeks ago, um, which obviously thanks to Nintendo's whole nonsense. I'm probably not going to play any games from it on there. Because, um, you know, they're just content ID the hell out of me, which they did on... What was it they content ID'd me on? Smash... No, Mario Kart. Not Smash Bros. Smash Bros. was fine, apparently. But, um, yeah, I got content ID'd on every Mario Kart episode I did. Which is fun. <laughs> Oh, it's Konami. That's the other company that I'm avoiding. They content ID on music a lot. So I'm being very cautious with Konami games. If I play Konami games, I'm going to turn the music off, most likely. Or turn it right down, which I might have to do with Square Enix as well, because there's amount of licensed music in Life is Strange. Try to avoid all that stuff. That's the thing. Right. Everyone's ill. Uh, let's keep both of us alive. I don't think we've got any poison cures. I don't think there was any in the thing. Right, what positions are you in? They're lined up. Uh, move from them. Oh, and we'll hit both of them. One dead? Nope. Uh, Tink, you can deal with that one. No combo. Weak. Right. Uh, she moves. Pretty moves there. Should be able to hit a pretty barrage. And not got much health left. That might actually pretty barrage might actually be enough to finish it. Ready, dude. I was saying, I'm playing a lot of Advance Wars. I'm playing it on the Wii. U. No, didn't finish it. Fuck no. But um, properly addicted to Advance Wars. I've forgotten there's not many stages to the campaign mode. And then I remembered halfway through it that you meant to select certain characters to um finish the campaign levels, aren't you? Um, to unlock all the levels. Because there's bonus rival clash levels that you can get as well if you play certain characters. So yeah, might have to play through it again. I've played through that game so much on the Game Boy Advance. One of my favourite games of all time. I'd love to play it on the channel. But um, yeah, I don't want to get my channel blocked or anything like that. Oh, ouch. That's not nice. Oh, she shot that poison arrow into my heart. Didn't poison me though. Right. Gonna keep Rosalind down here. So if Axel goes onto that panel, then I can blow it up. Right, triple strike. No, it's not that one. Which one is it? None of them. 
Yeah. Alright, that's the time we're up, so I'll just finish this episode and then, like, you know, be on our merry way. And hopefully I won't die this time. <laughs> right, Axel doesn't have a resistance to fire, but he's pretty good at not taking damage from it. So, uh, I'm just going to, yeah, I should keep the fire guy here and then, can I reach her with Mega Fire? Uh, oh, 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 there you go. Punch her in the back. It's a nice thing to do to a woman, obviously. Really? Shit. That's not helpful. What was up with the accuracy today? Oh, there you go, she's dead. Right. Let's get healing people. There you go. Whee! That'll help. And... Right. One, two, three. No, we need three, so... Pretty Barrage isn't going to help them, but... Let's move everyone onto the Defence Plus spots. And... It's not going to do any damage, but... Pff, may as well, just in case. Might do two damage or something. Ooh, did a little bit of damage. And yet missed the Archer Girl. Right, what I want to do is stop him from being able to move back onto that invincibility spot. Right, let's move her back. Uh, let's heal people again. Mega fire, do as much damage as possible. He's got nothing special going on. Unlike Stacy's mum. And Crimson Flame. Oh, she's in the way. What a bitch. Uh, nope. Nope. Right, let's move him. Can I hit the Tiger Flame thing from here? Tiger Charge? Nope. Just gonna have to punch him. Oh well. Be boring. Keep them healed up. And if I got surrounded, then Axel can't get around and... Oh, he's got that cross attack though, hasn't he? Ooh. Yeah, he's going to do that. <laughs> Ready, dude. Oh, at least the Prinny's doing quite a lot of damage, actually. Oh, go on, counter-attack Adele. Counter-attack Adele. There you go. Oh, sometimes counter-attacks are good. Adele didn't count back. Outrageous. Right, he is going to use this move where it fires off a, a cross pattern attack, which is going to probably kill everyone. Wicked. Didn't think that through. Yeah, yeah, shocking soul. Boom. Let's watch as half of my characters disappear, including my healer. Oh, shit. Well, that is a problem. Right, what's his range? Range is that far. And I can't get out of that range. <laughs> can't hit him with mega fire. What if I can lead him to a position where right. where Adele where Roslin can hit him? Let's get rid of that. Okay, next turn maybe. Nope, he's dead. My god, same situation as last time. And I went in with healing stuff this time. Right. I don't think there's any way that I can lead him up to the top. I don't think there is any way at all. Let's see. Will he come after her? I mean, I think she has to be within a range to, for him to even acknowledge that she's there. This is why I need more characters. <laughs> Let's see.
Hmm. He's not going to acknowledge. Right, I'll tell you what. I'm going to end that episode there. I'm going to get this done and posted. And then tomorrow's Saturday. So tomorrow, I'm going to do another episode where I beat this guy. This went badly. I'm really not, I'm just rushing through it. That's the problem, isn't it? I'm not levelling up first. Right, I'm going to level up. I'll catch you later. Bye.